Okay, today we're going to be doing a startup of a Virgin, what I believe to be a 1970s GTE Sylvania 175 watt mercury vapor H39 um, DX, which is color corrected for better color rendering, mercury vapor bulb. I got these at a place called Joseph Fazio Industrial Steel and Hardware. It's sort of like a uh, place you go and get um, with the bulb over so you can see that while I'm blabbing. There we go. And it's a place you go and get like industrial salvage and stuff like that. So they have this place uh, called Loft One, which is basically all electrical equipment from old factories and had all kinds of old fashioned clocks and switches and fuse boxes and the stuff I'd be comfortable in saying is probably all of it at least 35 years old because it's from a lot of it was from the 60s 70s I didn't see very anything that I recognized or <laughs> knew what the purpose was but there was an entire section on vintage HID lights and screw this in so you get going and they had a whole shelves all kinds of shelves full of old vacuum tubes and these HID bulbs most of them were metal halide and uh, high pressure sodium those weren't that old uh, like probably 20 years or so some of them they had a uh, thousand watt mercury vapor bulb which I was going to buy it was two dollars but it was used so I didn't want to buy a used one you never know if it works or not you know all right let's get started cross your fingers don't know if this oh, it does work As you can see, we're approaching full power now. Should also mention that this is the Grand Light 175 watt uh, mercury vapor fixture from 2006 that I took out of one of the light fixtures at work. I replace it with a high pressure sodium. It's one from the other videos. the logo on the front so it's burning.
hard to focus when it's this bright. Okay, that was the startup of the Virgin GTE Sylvania 175 watt DX mercury vapor bulb from the 1970s. They gave you a date code uh, decoder on the box, which is over there. But um, I'm not sure where you locate it because the little date code isn't where they said it was supposed to be. Well, anyway, that's it for now.